guys welcome back to my channel thank you for coming if you're new here please subscribe and if you're coming back thank you please like comment share and click on the notification bell now i've got that out of the way ignore this voice i have a cold and my nose is blocked i don't really sound this crazy um so today i'm going to be speaking about something that could be controversial could be i don't know how it's going to be received or how it's gonna yeah i don't know but um take it how you will <laughs> so in terms of like because obviously the title is here so you can see in terms of black people or black balloon artists Apart from Top Air Bulladay and Viola from Viola Party um, Heaven, I don't really know many other big black balloon artists. And you know when I see, and this has nothing to do with racism before anyone starts, oh, it's got nothing to do with racism. It's just like, how do we get our faces up there as well? Like when you look at a lot of the magazines, apart from Top Air and Viola, I don't really see any other people. When you look at a lot of the magazines, when you look at a lot of the um, faces that are out there, they're not black. So it's like, okay, are we just not trying enough? Is there a trick that we're missing? Because I don't have the answer. So it's like, it's kind of like a conversation or a discussion without anyone speaking back to me. Because <laughs> I, I genuinely don't have the answer. But obviously, this could be an ongoing conversation that, you know, we could have like you could dm me and stuff cause, oh balloons by sylvia that's who i am in case you don't know um so yeah it's like how do we get ourselves out there what can we do to put ourselves make ourselves more visible you know like when it comes to training courses and stuff i I think i've only ever seen um adorable balloons um uh, do like a training course and i i think i only saw that from her page i don't think i've seen many other black balloon artists doing training courses so is it that we're not doing the training courses or we're just not finding it as easy to get a space or you know are we just not bothered about doing it are we just are, are we the problem are we just trying to keep everything to ourselves is that the issue i don't know so when i say this is a conversation it is a conversation because it is it something that we're doing and obviously i'd love to have people's videos back and all people's like messages or comments so that it can be a discussion. Is it, are we not doing enough? So it's either we're not doing enough or we're just not being given the opportunities to um, put ourselves out there. And I know that, and I can't even say we're not good enough because I've seen many um, black balloon artists work and it's incredible. So it's like, okay, so with their incredible work, why is it just that it's remained on their pages? It's not broadcasted as often like if you see a lot of the um pages that broadcast of work you don't really see many black balloon artists work broadcasted or advertised or reposted should i say a lot um you have a few but it's not from what i've seen or maybe i'm just not looking in the right places you know but from what i've seen it's like they can tag away and it's not their work that is being seen like that you know when it comes to reels and stuff are we just not doing enough are we you know and i i know that we're good enough so it's like what is the issue you know are we hoarders are we just not sharing enough because i know that a lot of people that get likes and stuff on reels are people that um share what they do so are we not sharing enough are we keeping too much to ourselves i remember i did join a um, um I won't say the name actually. I joined a Facebook group that had to do with supporting black business. And I don't feel like I was supported or my business was really supported. I feel like it was more attacked in a way because number one, people always wanted a mad discount. I remember one time I put something on there about the what the design that I'm I'm doing wasn't within the no, was the client had a specific budget and the design that I was doing, um, had to meet their budget or something on the lines i'm paraphrasing and i got a hundred and something notifications and i was shocked and people were like oh why would you put that about the budget and blah blah and i was like this is one of the issues i have because we're supposed to be supporting black business you have an issue with the fact that i put the word budget but when it comes to be posted by work you scroll past and don't like but when you see something like the word budget 
that now is a trigger for you and now you start to attack rather than encourage or maybe if you didn't like that word or thought that because I did have some people message me directly like oh maybe you should word it differently next time but honestly I don't think there was anything with the way I wrote it because I just wrote everyone in life has a budget for everything and sometimes you want to stick within that budget that's no problem so why would anyone have an issue with that I, I really don't know I don't know but let's not attack ourselves let's help let's encourage let's support each other because at the end of the day if we support each other and we lift each each other up then it's more likely than not that we will elevate each other and maybe be able to get our names out there maybe maybe be able to get our businesses out there rather than finding a way to attack each other or find a loophole 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 <laughs> Obviously, this is something like, you know, when you're talking, I just like, it's, it's just doing you. It's like, you're just passionate because it's like, it's just, yeah. In terms of supporting each other, we need to do a whole lot more. Um, but in terms of us getting our names out there, I really don't know. I don't have the answer for that. So if anyone else does, then please feel free to, um, yeah, feel, please feel free to comment and let us know if there's anything that we're doing that basically if we're missing a beat. You know, if there's anything else that we need to do to get our names out there. When I see, like, all these other pages that, um, how do I put it now? Yeah, like, I even tried to join one company who broadcasts. They have, they're a balloon brand. I'm not going to mention who they are. And they have, like, people that work for them and, you know, do, the, like, wear their uniform and showcase for them. And it's like, I realised that they I haven't seen any black people on their team. And when you see a lot of these companies and a lot of these brands that have teams and stuff, you rarely, and I'm not saying they're not before anyone comes to me, I just don't remember seeing any black faces on their teams. And I feel like, you know, they need to do better because you can't say that we're not applying. I specifically messaged or emailed this company to see how I could um, be a part of the team. Um... Because obviously I feel like sometimes I do like good creation and stuff. And so it's not as if that, it's not as if my work isn't good enough. So what is the problem? I think that it took them even a long time before they even got back to me in the first place. Um, and when they did, it was just like, mm, it's supposed to be a kind of answer. So yeah, what can we do to get our names out there, our faces out there? Because once we get our faces out there, it's an encouragement as well to others, you know, that it can be done. And it's not, um, and at this point, now that you know that we want to be out there, now that you know that we have this interest, is that for you to kind of, and if you're watching this and you're a brand, for you to do what you can to facilitate that and do what you can to put our faces out there and show that oh, you might have missed a beat and not intentionally, but now you know, you know, what can you do to kind of um, put other um other races out there other colors other you know shades and all of that kind of stuff so yeah if this triggers you well <laughs> like i said it's not a racism thing but if it triggers you thank you for listening i hope that video was useful and if you do have any um tips and you know or any just conversation it can be a conversation starter this is just my opinion. This is my view, but that doesn't make it 100% correct. So I'm happy to have those conversations with you. Like I said, I'm Balloons by Sylvia. So holler at me on Instagram. I don't really use like um, other social media that much. I'm mainly an Instagram YouTube girl now. So yeah, please holler at me and I'm happy to have those conversation discussions. If you have a video to send back, you know, either in support or not, you know, I'm happy to play your video as well and just show your opinion or what you may have as facts. So yeah, thank you for joining today and take care. Bye.